thank you. Thank you very much for the opportunity to speak this morning. Um, I wanted to introduce myself because I know there's a lot of y'all that I haven't had the opportunity to meet yet. But as um, Manuel mentioned, I'm running for commissioner's court in Precinct 3 here in Bear County. And as he said, that's the northern part of Bear County. Um, traditionally, it's been considered a Republican stronghold. There hasn't been a Democrat to have this seat in more than 50 years. So we're trying to definitely flip this uh, seat. Um, commissioner's court, there's only ever been two women on the court. And so um, I'm trying to become the third. And if I am, I will be the first Latina on the court, which that's something that, um, frankly, it's taken too long. There should have been more women at this point, And there definitely should have been more Latinas and Latinos on the court. Um, just a little bit about my background. I'm a practicing attorney. I do mostly children's court cases. So I do the abuse and neglect cases where I represent children. Uh, before becoming an attorney, I worked worked as a congressional aide in Massachusetts for Senator Ted Kennedy, where I did veterans affairs work. Um, so I have a lot of background um, in advocacy, and I'm trying to bring those skills to work for us in Precinct 3. Now, um, this morning, the, the Express News ran a story on my race, and in that in that story, I'm very clear that if elected, I will represent all the people of Precinct 3. Um, you can read it for yourselves. Um, my opponent has already said that she's concerned about Republicans. She didn't mention wanting to help all the rest of us. She didn't mention wanting to help any uh, Latinos or any other, other, other people other than Republicans. So I think that's something that um, we need to pay attention to. And um, I'll, in the chat, I'll go ahead and I'll share my uh, website just so you can take a look when you have time. But I appreciate the opportunity this morning to speak to you and I look forward to um, your support and turning Texas blue in November.